Yeah, I welcome you all to today's training and today we'll be talking about affiliate marketing and um, I promised to release a new video on a free way you can make money online, right? Yeah, I told you guys uh, my last my last video that I'm try I was trying a means, uh, a strategy that is free, absolutely free and I actually tried it I discovered that that particular platform is not worthy to give a try. It's not worthy for me to share with you guys. So I left it. I actually tried that platform and I was able to make up to a thousand dollars from that platform, but withdrawal was an issue. I couldn't be able to withdraw the money. That means they are scam. So they are just using people's, uh, taking people's time and all that. So that is a lot of things uh, I try to make sure in my channel. Anytime you come here, you get something that is real, real value, and something that is working perfectly well. I know many of you might have. It's possible for you to jump up the video because I've talked about this uh, Digistore 24 affiliate marketing with uh, JVZoo Warrior Plus in my previous videos. But I want to talk about a, a, a strategy, promotion strategy that it works very well that I have used in the past. I'm still using as I talk to you now. You're going to see it. I'll show you proof. And it's working very, very fine. Please and please do not kick off this video. Do not kick off the video. As a matter of fact, I want you to subscribe if you're a newbie. And this is the first time you are in my channel. Every every week I release new videos on how to make money online, different ways. I share something proving something other persons will charge you to teach you. I share it on my channel every single week. And for you to get it, all you need to do is what subscribe. Click the subscribe button right now to the channel and also turn on the notification bar as I talk right now. Do it, and um, you'll be happy yourself as you help me as well. You'll be happy yourself that once I release a new video. Will be among the first persons to get it so today i'm already on digital 24 platform and a lot of persons who have heard of this who is here who will be hearing uh, of this platform for the first time who is will be like what is digital 24 and all that it's an affiliate marketing platform and in case you don't know what an affiliate marketing is all about an affiliate marketing is simply let me use a layman language a platform whereby you you, you promote people's products you promote people's products and they get paid why they get paid? They pay you commission. All right. Okay. Like uh, this, this two twenty four now. You can see this product. Okay. Uh, this Wesley product. Um, uh, a friend of mine as well. Uh, he's not a Nigerian. You can see his product. His commission rate is ninety percent commission. That is amazing. That means for each product you sell, he gives you ninety percent commission for each sale. It's almost like he's giving you all the money and any part. Of this product is actually thirty seven USD. Now, how do you get to this place? For those who have been complaining, I have received a series of complaints, up to a couple of complaints from my students that uh, Digital24 is no longer accepting Nigerians and all that. I have mentioned, I made mention of that in one of my videos before. I don't know how, um, because Digital24 is still working for me. This is not actually even a new account. I created a new account to make this video and it still works fine, right? So uh, I don't know why people are saying it's not working for them. And uh, it, this might be possibly true, but you don't need to don't place if the so 24 doesn't work for you you can use warrior plus it will definitely work you can use jvzoo it will definitely work just check my affiliate marketing video on jvzoo or warrior plus then use it and the most important thing about this video we are going to make making today is the promotion strategy i want us to use they are the adverts i will be running the promotion strategy is what is important so not the affiliate marketing platform in case you don't know how i arrived here all you need to do is to come to the uh, your new tab Type digistore24.com, all right? Digistore24.com. Then once it opens, then the next thing for you to do is to go to marketplace. Once it opens, you go to marketplace. So you first create your account. Sorry, uh, I'm jumping still because I know there are newbies who will be watching this videos now. So let me break it down very well. So you click on register this register button here. Once you click on register, it will take you to the process of registration process. Just register your account. Once you're done, make sure you uh, go back to your email and verify your account. They will send you an email for verification. Once you verify your account, you will land 
yourself in this page now from there you click on marketplace here you can see marketplace here click on marketplace then it will, you, it, will, it will land you in this page so as simple as that once you're here now we are going to look for product to promote myself i love make money product a lot i love um because that is my niche that is my favorite niche so you can see betting system business invest and investment all these categories are under make money product some of them so uh you, people some some persons promote health and fitness they can promote relationship dating love and relationship and all that music computer and internet any any niche you want to promote just make sure you choose a niche please don't just come here start looking for products randomly and you say no make sure you what you are promoting a product on a particular niche please i'm emphatic about, about this because it's very important this uh let me go through some of this uh, uh this uh, um platform for those who will be watching for the first time this is a product by wesley as you can see the product is actually uh, overnight millionaire it's a make money product teaching people how to make money with affiliate marketing as well now you are not buying this product you want to promote the product this is the product link can you see once you click on this place now i click i right click i click on copy or i can click here it will take me to the um product page so once i click on copy I have copied the affiliate link now what is the difference between uh this platform digital 24 and um warrior plus and jvzu the difference and clickbank is that clickbank and warrior plus uh, uh, sorry and digital 24 functions are uh, uh, alike now it's unfortunate that nigerians can no longer use clickbank for some years now or uh, more than five years now clickbank stopped nigerians from using them because of fraud and all that but these platforms that allow nigerians to use them uh, digital 24 is similar to clickbank because you don't request in most of the products you don't need to request for what for the vendor to give you permission if i go to for instance let's say warrior plus now if i go to warriorplus.com before i can be able to promote a product i need to request for permission please i won't be doing training on warrior plus for today or jvzu if you are looking for that check my previous videos it should put you through on that all right so now will all be requesting for permission in this that is but in warrior plus and jvzu you will need to request permission but in digital 24 and clickbank there is no permission you will just see your what your link your affiliate link your promotion link direct here in most of the product not all the products anyway so you can see this particular one this is to mastery up and monetization okay bypass math pass you can see it's giving 50 percent commission but the product is kind of a little bit expensive expensive the product is what 146 right so you can see it here uh all right so just you can see the commission but before you promote the product there are some things you put into consideration let me just run through some of these things you put at you look at the commission rate all right you also look at the refund rate you look at the conversion rate you can see cut conversion is nine nine percent let's look at this second one um conversion you also look at cancellation rate okay look at this one Cancellation rate is 15 percent, 15 or 6 percent. That is kind of high, but I know this guy, this his product is very good. Then you can see this guy, cancellation rate is 24.2 percent. That is that is crazy. That means those who have actually requested for what is cancellation rate, please, people, if you are promoting this product, it means that among all the people that have, that have promoted this product, that this product have had about 24.2 translation rate that is too much please you can't promote a product like that because you end up seeing running adverts you waste money run advert waste your time run advert people see the products and at the end they request for refund or they cancel their order they don't want to buy the product again maybe the product is not what they expected to see and you know these are transparent platforms once you get the product and you, you, you think it's not what you bargained for you can actually cancel your order that is for warrior plus and jvzu here uh you can actually request for uh, a request for refund but here you cancel order that's why you are you can see in, in warrior plus and jvzu what you'll be seeing is refund rate here is called cancellation rate they are the same thing so you can see um the price of the, the average price of the product is 377 then uh, uh also look at the earning per sale so this will end per sale all right so um but again the other thing you look at the sales rank okay these are some of the things you put into consideration while promoting a product 
all right we can see this six rank is ranking number one is that is that good so that is very good now having considered these things you pick a product in your niche let's assume we want to promote this first product uh, of wesley products here i copy the uh, this link and go to uh, bitly.com and uh, shorten the link if i want i don't know i know bitly is a common this and just go to bit bit.li right look at it here bit.li that is where you shorten the link once you open it you you click on you click on that and you shorten the link let me open it here so once you're here you click on create once you click on create okay then uh you paste your link here once you paste your link here uh, what what will happen you can click on create and if you want you can title you can give your link a title so you give it a title and you will see the shortened url this is it. it once you click on that you ask it to give it a title let me give it a title uh uh example let me call it example example test okay i'll click on save then i copy my link my shortened link now any place i share this link and people click on it this is what happens once people click on that link they will be redirected to the sales page of Wesley products. As once they get the, to the sales page, Wesley will do what? We must have do, uh, done a very nice sales page for them to buy. At the end, as many that buy the products, the money will come and reflect in your own account, not the total money. The commission rates, the money will pay to Wesley, not you directly. Okay, but it's, everything is automated. Once the money is paid to Wesley and it's coming from your own link from your own unique affiliate link that is this link you are seeing here because it's from your, from your own account make sure you have logged in before you do this thing you've created the account and log in then it will reflect in your own amount here once you come to your dashboard in fact immediately you log in that is what you see the first thing you see in this situation is statistics of your sales you see there you see the amount you have paid per day you see the amount you have paid per month amount you have paid per social period of time the number of sales the number of people that have clicked on your link and all that so a bitly also help you to track the number of people that click on that link so when you are checking you should be able to see okay so some number of persons have clicked on this link and let's say out of 1000 people that click on this link 500 number of them bought the product all right that is good that is good it bought the product and uh wesley will pay you per one and at the end you'll be able to withdraw your money this thing is very cool and very simple now affiliate marketing is broad listen to me affiliate marketing i'm just teaching you this all this thing i'm explaining is just the basis i have a food a full training course on affiliate marketing i have a full training course about cut something videos on affiliate marketing that have to do with step-by-step -step approach and precept upon precepts which if you want to enroll the, the training course is actually paid it's not free actually so if you need my full training course on affiliate marketing you just check me up or look for me to reach out reach out to me and i'll give it to you but meanwhile what I'm trying to say is for those who don't really have capital to start, they don't have capital to buy the affiliate marketing course, but they just want to start anyhow and make money, you can actually try these strategies. Actually working. There are some things I will jump in because um I believe I'm talking to beginners and this is YouTube. I don't want to make the video too long. So you can actually enjoy the video as well and um get the best out of the video. Now, there's something we call promotional strategy. I'll talk about one aspect and uh I won't talk about all the strategy we use for promotion because there are there are lots about these things. There are a lot of these things I won't be talking about here, but just follow this particular one aspect I'll be talking about. And today we'll be talking about paid advert with Facebook. I know a lot of you, in fact, the most commonest uh advert right now, uh for about 10 years now, has been Facebook ad. A lot of you have heard of Facebook ad. Yeah, I know I adverts is very important please pay attention let me tell you the truth where many of you have failed in business is adverts so many persons sell a lot of good things you, you got affiliate product to sell you have your own product to sell you don't want to spend money in ad it doesn't work that way you must be able to spend a little time with ad it's very important you must be able to spend some money in ad as a matter of fact you didn't spend money creating this account all you are paying for is for the adverts and this advert is very important because that is where you get to watch 
sell your product. A lot of persons like free ads, they are looking for free ads. Some persons take out the whole time. Now, let me ask you if you're part of them, how many of those free ads is actually working perfectly well for you? I'm not saying that free ads doesn't work. I've talked in my channel a couple of videos where I, I show you some free uh, uh, free means of getting ad, but it is for low traffic. It will, you, it will stress you a lot. It will take your time, waste your time, stress you, and at the end, you won't get better results. The truth is hard. I know a lot of persons on their channel, on their YouTube channel, they just try to give you scrap. They don't care to know if it's working for you or if it's not working for you. Yeah, if I if I make a video and I get a report like a, a student or someone, a subscriber to come to tell me, I, I've tried this now, it's not actually working for me very well. I feel bad. I feel like, whoa, no, I shouldn't make it fast. Most times I go back to delete the video. If I try it at all, except the person is not getting it very well, I make sure that everything I'm trying to teach you is actually working and it's working for me. And today we'll be trying a new approach on Facebook ad that is actually working. Uh, please and um, please pay attention to this video. Uh, the uh, Facebook ad is very wide, but we'll be trying something simple and uh, something straightforward. I won't be going into this is a, a full training on uh, Facebook ad. I just wanted to show you how you can be able to promote your affiliate products in this unique strategy. The first thing for you to do is to create a Facebook account if you don't have one. Once you've done that, I won't be going through that process right now. Then you create a Facebook business account. Just come to this, uh, open the tab, go to business dot facebook.com do you see that business dot facebook.com uh you can actually run your ad from your own pers facebook personal account but i don't like that because if you ban the account ban the ad account uh it means that your ad, uh, personal ad account is banned but with business ad account you can have your you can go about that and all that and uh, i have a course on facebook ad where i teach people how to avoid facebook from banning your account i've been running ad back to back and actually see that facebook there is no way that Facebook can buy your account if you follow those process. If you need the cost, you can also, also get to me. I'll give you the cost. Now, once I we go to business.facebook.com, it will open up a business account. I link to this. I decided to use my students' ad accounts, not mine. So we are here on um, the ad account. This is not my uh, business ad account. This I am using a, an account for my student. You can see here, Jerry Boy. That is uh, the student of my. I'm trying to run an ad for him with his Facebook account. So so far, the ad we are running will spend like uh, 29 USD. With nine bucks in the ad. Now, if this is, if it's your first time of opening business manager ad account. You are going so the platform won't, won't be looking like this you should be looking something new so you have to what create a new account once you've created a new account then you can create a, a, a page that is facebook page create a facebook page that is simple once you've done that then you can now create your uh ad accounts uh before you once you're done creating your uh business ad account then it should appear like this you're going to see your this is my the page we are using for this advice called issue training and skills you can see that that is the page the name of the page so you will see the page don't click on the page from here then click on the ad account okay if the ad account is not there then you click on this place this setting button and create an ad account from here once you click on this place then it will show you where you can set up your billing and all that your audience manager so you can as well create your audience separately then create your billing i'm sorry i'm rushing this way this Facebook ad is something that is, a, is very broad. It's something I take all time teaching. I have I have a full training course, about 32 videos training course on Facebook ad alone. So imagine trying to compress one on one other objective together. So you see, it won't be that easy. But um, I'll try as much as possible to go over it. Those who can actually grab this and try it out can grab it. So now go to what ad manager, set up your ad account. You can see ad account setting. Yeah, you click on it to set up your ad account. Once you are done 
with that you've done that then um you will click on um you come and click on the other account you've created right for here this is the other account we've created i'll click on it on it right now so once i click on the other account it will start opening Let's wait for it to get loaded. Why is loading? I want you to pay attention to this. This is a unique Facebook ad strategy. This, this is not a, I know a lot of persons who don't know how to run ad on Facebook. I wish time permits me to teach you the best means of running ad for Facebook on promoting affiliate marketing. Whenever you want to run ad for Facebook, it depends on what you want to sell. I, I get a lot of persons. You can pay for ad of it. I have seen some people paying thousands of dollars on Facebook, hundreds and thousands of dollars, and without getting any results. The reason is not far from now, from here. It's just that you are not running the right kind, the right kind of ad, and there are a lot of secrets when it comes to Facebook ad. You need to know. Lastly, I want to say this: Facebook is not actually. I don't use Facebook as my mainstream of promoting affiliate products. I use um, PPV ad networks. And some other ad strategy like variety traffic and all that so if you want that package or my ad campaign package i've included both facebook ad both uh, viral traffic machine and the new ad system i also use for my promotion promoting my affiliate marketing products my digital marketing products and all that if you want that particular training just hit up to me i'm going to give you the full training on ad that contains both youtube ad google ad facebook ad viral traffic uh, machine and all the ad networks I've learned and I'm currently using to crush all my products, I'm going to give you all the ad apps. arrange all the ad net, all the ad trainings in one course, and I'm giving it out to students who are, who are in process, who actually want to make money online, who want to go into online business full time. You cannot do away with ad. It's not possible, okay? You cannot do away with ad. So I wanted the campaign to load, so you can see the campaign we've done in this account. Currently, I think uh, the account is due for charge, and um, I pause the charge so it won't be. Uh, I, I don't allow the charge to uh, allow Facebook to charge it automatically, so we can actually know how much we spend and try to track the campaign if it's uh, uh, converting very well and all that. But once you open like this, what the first thing for you to do is to come and click on create. And mind you, you can do this thing with your mobile phone. In fact, I create my ad. All this ad I created with my mother, with my mobile phone. So you can create your ad with your mobile phone very well. It is more easier like that. But for uh, if you have a laptop here, it's more easier, like more faster on mobile phone, but more easier here rather. It will be more easier with you here because you're going to see all the interface and all that. So the next thing for us to do is to click on create, right? Oh, for the one I run for my students here, let's look at something. You can see the results here. You can see the lowest cost. We actually we actually use lead generation. Uh, from this one, we generated about uh, 158 lead, and from here, 128 lead. You can see cost per action is 0.09 uh, dollar. That is per landing. Before you to get one lead, you pay 0.09 dollars. And now, this that is why I talk about Facebook ad. This 0.09. A lot of persons will look at it and say that this is very cheap. This is so cheap. No. It is not cheap when you compare to the kind of ad I'm going to teach you. If you get my training ad, I'm going to show you where you are. Instead of getting paying for 0 0.09 per course, you are going to get this in for 0 0.001. 0 0.001 cost per action will be 0 0.001. Remember here is 0 0.09. I know I can still recite this ad campaign that this cost per action on Facebook, the minimum I can get on Facebook here will cost per action will be. 0.01 but that will give you 0.001 because when we started running this campaign we are charging not at 0 0.02 when 0 0.02 they keep on increasing it sometimes it goes down and like that the cost per action or per result is not always steady depending on the ad i've changed ad networks and the ad objective a couple of times so now and uh, we've been able to get uh, two, uh 228 lead i run this i ran this campaign for two days and i post it all right, so you click on create. Then I will show you my own personal ad account. You see over 200 campaigns run within two months 
on Facebook ad. And some person will be like, oh, but you don't like Facebook and you still run campaigns because I manage ad accounts for students. So all of them, I use my personal ad account, but I run it for students, for students of mine who their specific interest doesn't match other ad, but Facebook ad. Mind you, Facebook ad is still one of the best when it comes to targeting. In fact, when it comes to targeting so far, Facebook ad is actually one of the best because their targeting is top niche. Now, once you click on create, whether you are using your mobile phone or anything you are using, it should land you up to something like this. You are going to see brand awareness, reach, traffic. This is called what you call ad objective or campaign objective. Now, just as the word implies objective, what is your objective? Now, some persons will just come, even uh, write some description in their post and boost post. That thing is arrant rubbish. If you have been doing that, I want to tell you, you have been wasting a lot of money. Stop doing that. It's not how to run Facebook ad. Stop doing boost posts. That is not how to run Facebook ad. This over nine years experience in doing this. I have been doing running Facebook ad since I started my online business. And um, I can tell you there is no all this campaign objective. I have run all of them a couple of times. So now Facebook used to introduce new ones sometimes. Like this uh, catalog sales was not there. This uh, store traffic was not there some time ago. It was introduced. Even lead generation was not there some time ago. So many years ago, it was introduced. Now, for the purpose of what we want to do today, I'll be using lead generation. The reason why I want to use lead generation is that now I want to consider that you don't have a website. We're not going to be promoting our affiliate link directly. Please mind you, we might not be promoting our affiliate link directly. So since you don't have a website, then we'll be using this platform. We are using it to do what? To do what traffic would have done for us, if we are to use traffic card, what will happen is that we have to create a website, what we call a sales funnel. Inside our funnel, we, con we contain what? A landing page where people will do what? We subscribe. People will do what? They will enter their names and their email address and they will subscribe to our list. They will have their names and their email address in our email list, in our autoresponder list. And with that, we can be able to what sell our product to them. See, that is sell this affiliate marketing to them via email marketing. That is how, in fact, that is how top gurus are doing it even till now. Not too many persons are using this strategy I want to use, meaning that you don't even need to create a website. You don't even need to create a landing page. Facebook have done everything for you, and that is what we call lead generation ad. All right? Lead generation ad means that Facebook has done the whole work for you. You don't need to create an uh, uh, to create a, a website, a landing page. You don't need all that. All you need to do is to come and click on lead generation. So uh, it's similar. The same thing you're going to get in traffic, get in lead generation. But actually, from experience, lead generation costs lower than traffic if you do your work very well. Now, once I click on lead generation, I click on what continue. So once I click on continue, it will bring me to this page. Please pay attention. All Facebook, most of this ad you are going to run, you are going to meet this thing. In all the ad objective you are going to run on Facebook, you are going to miss it. You are going to meet your campaign, your campaign, your ad set, and your ad. Now, your campaign is just where you will set your budget and your campaign name. This thing doesn't really matter. The campaign name, you can name it anything. You can even put your name here. So it doesn't show up to anything. It's just for you to know. If you are running different, like that ad network, that ad, the former ad I show you, the one I ran for this student, you can see I name. I have about six campaigns. If you, if I scroll down, you see different different campaigns. You can see the ones for. So so let me say I'm running. I'm running like three businesses. One is dropshipping. One is affiliate marketing. One is e-commerce, and the other one is digital marketing. So I can create different ad on all of them on Facebook and name their campaigns separately. So let me say this one is. Let me just call it test campaign. All right. Let me call it test campaign. It doesn't matter as I told you. So now, if you want to edit your uh, campaign details, like your uh, buying type, I always like to use that option. So you leave your own option. So the ad generation is, is actually a little objective. We have chosen it before. If you want to edit it at a point, you can edit it from here. But we want it to be lead, lead generation. So we scroll down. So the next thing for us to do now is to edit our... Our price. 
So you come and turn bo campaign budget and op optimization, you turn it on because it's off. So you can see it's off, you turn it on. Once you turn it on, you can now see your budget here. So uh, here you, you put your daily budget. If you look, you take a look, uh, uh, detailed look at the one I showed you earlier, the one I, the campaign I, I, I told you I paused, I was running. You can see I use $4 per day. Now, this pay attention on this. A lot of persons like, they will tell you that uh, a lot of people that teach Facebook, uh, they will tell you use $10 from above, $10 and above and per day for your ad. Please, if you want your ad, if you want Facebook to come, give you the best conversion, use little amount of money. Me, myself, if I want to run a fresh ad, I normally use $5 per day. Then, when the ad start running and start converting, Facebook will be the one to uh, structure the ad in a way. They see that because you are telling Facebook, I don't have capital to run ad. I have limited resources to run ad. And I want you to maximize it for me. Facebook would know how to what? Make use of your resources and maximize your, your resources for you. That is how Facebook works. So here, I will use $4. I either use $5 or $4 for a start. So you might look as if it's small. And for those of you who will say, let me use $1, $1 please, it's too small. Don't use that. You are going to let, get a very low uh, um, ad. It's good. You run your ad and you, you start to see results immediately. You get a poor result if you use one dollar. I've never, I've never used anything below four dollars before. So use four or five dollars, and don't use ten dollars. Even if you have the capital, don't use ten dollars. Later, you can increase your budget as you, as the ads start running. You can increase your budget for now. Use only four dollars. So once you've done that, then you click on next. All right. If you look at this now, you see that it's have jumped from what. The campaign name we have given it a name. It's not test campaign. This is now the new ad set. Ad set now we have to give our ad set a name. So, uh, let's call it uh, test ad set. As I say, this name doesn't matter. Just for you to know the ad particular ad set. Now, what is ad set? Ad set is where you set your ad, as in where you make your you, you have your uh, set of ad in. And uh, inside this asset, you just have a few things you are going to do inside. Uh, we are going to do our targeting inside the asset, and we are going to choose our location and all that. So we'll go our targeting and do our placement. That is the basic thing that we do in asset targeting and what placement. So now, what do you mean by targeting? This is where Facebook beat a lot of ad platforms. It's in targeting because Facebook. If I explore targeting, if you watch, if you've gotten access to my full ad, ad, ad training before, you will see that I spent almost one hour on, on targeting alone on uh, 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 audience because there are what we call custom audience, have look alike audience, and different kind of audience. And these things might sound strange to some newbies. If you are into it already, I know it's something you've been doing over time. So, but uh, for the purpose of this training, for us to be able to rush and achieve our targets. I will just go straight to the point. So, we'll so go with some kind of uh, little targeting. When it comes to this place, you are some people will just choose Nigeria, choose their this thing, age range, and all that. But there are more to it. So, you can click on um, edit targeting here and edit your targeting, or you can come back to this place and click here. Once you click here, this is the, the best way to do it. To get a best targeting, then you click on audience. Are you with me? You click on audience, which will take you to the audience. Now, from the audience, you, you, you name the audience and set up an audience, and then do a detailed targeting on the audience. Uh -huh. This one is very good. Here, that is where you're gonna go, you're going to see all the kind of uh, first, we're gonna show you all the uh, uh, kind of um, audience, and you'll be the one to choose the best one for you. So this is the best way to do it. And once you're done from here, you click on save. It will be saved. And once you come to this place, when you're running the ad, you can actually select your audience. You can see save. Uh, you can select the audience. You see it. You can select it from here. Let me go up so you can see the ones I've saved here before. Once I click on this use saved audience, you see that I've saved that audience here before. I can, I can select it. So, but because I don't want to use safe audience, I want to show you how to set it up yourself too. I'll just go through this easier one. I'll come to this place. I'll click on here. You can see here. Um, 
detail targeting is off, I will turn it on. I will edit it. Click on edit here. And once you click on edit, it will take you to a place where you can choose your detail, detail targeting. So from here, I can actually uh, do what I call um, interest. You can choose your add your demography or interest or behavior. So let's say we are promoting that product. That is the product we are actually promoting. As you know, the product we chose we chose from uh, Digital Twenty Four. Let me go back to that place. You can see this particular product that I have to do is an affiliate marketing product. So let me come to my targeting. You see what I'm going to choose. How I'm going to target my my watch. This is what makes you a pro in R. This is what actually makes your art to be the best and makes your art to convert very well. I will show you why targeting is very good. And those who are using broad targeting, why you are missing money and you are wasting money on ad. Because broad targeting is the worst targeting you can do. Narrow targeting is the best you can ever think of. Now, I will come and write marketing. Just watch me. Marketing. I'll copy it. So, As you can see, Facebook could have brought down marketing for me, different marketing. Then I will choose the interest marketing first. I'll, I'll choose it once I click on it, it will be marked. The network, network is kind of slow. If the network is strong here, it will be marked fast immediately. So you can see it, it has added up. Then I'll paste the marketing again because there are more to marketing I want to choose. So there are more to marketing I want to choose. And um because why am I selecting marketing? Because what I want to promote is related to marketing, right? It's have to do with marketing. That is the reason why I'm selecting marketing. What I want to promote has to do with what? Affiliate marketing products. So let me assume, okay, when I was promoting my, uh, uh, what is it called? My uh, dropshipping products, I just did so very few keywords on dropshipping and it sold like, it, it was, it gave me one of the best sales that year. That was 2018. Now you can see viral marketing. You can see promotional marketing. You keep on choosing them one by one. Keep on choosing them one by one. So you can even see influencer marketing, digital marketing, uh, email marketing. Are you seeing content marketing? If you keep on going down, you see affiliate marketing. And you can see affiliate marketing. I'll click on it. So you keep on cl clicking those marketing. These are targeted keywords that people are searching on Facebook. People that have to do with marketing. Now, Facebook is going to show your ad to only people that are interested in anything that have to do with marketing. Now, let me tell you why this uh, uh, audience uh, is very important. Imagine that you didn't do a targeted audience and Facebook showed your ad to everybody on Facebook that is in Nigeria. You just chose Nigeria. You didn't do, do, do it well. What will happen is that your ad, you can see I've pasted it again. I've selected you. Let me do digital marketing. Now, you add a lot of persons who don't have interest, people that are looking for weight loss, people that are looking for uh, love life and dating and relationship, people that are looking for church and uh, mosque, religion. So everybody will just be seeing your ad. And for each person that Facebook shows your ad, for each audience, you, you keep on having a large audience. You, might, you won't pay per people that see your ad. You are paying per cost per action, right? But at the end, you keep on meeting thousands of persons that are seeing your ad and you're not clicking on your link, they're not interested, our Facebook will discover that that ad is not converting. They will start charging you higher on that ad because the ad is not converting very well. Okay? Now, another person who wants to run this ad, if I want to run this ad, I want to make it perfect targeting. I won't choose all this, I won't even choose marketing because marketing is very broad. You can see the million, it's about 9.1 million people that are interested in marketing. So if I'm, if I'm doing my targeting on, on Facebook, I just make it like 2 million, a million people or 2 million people. I'm okay with that. That means if I want to achieve that, I will go to a more narrow targeting. Marketing is very broad. If I go to only affiliate marketing, that means only people, people that will be seeing this product are people that are interested in only affiliate marketing in Nigeria. But mind you, once I'm done, I'll go up. I'll change the location because this is affiliate marketing. We're not promoting to Nigerians. Mind you, we are not selling to Nigerians. We are not doing what? Promoting this product to Nigerians. We are targeting the United States. So I'll come to the search. I'll click on USA. 
Okay, I think United United States. Now I might not be able to just choose United States. I can choose a let me say I want to move to uh, California because United States is very wide. Or Texas. Let me say I'm choosing Texas for this uh ad. Uh, I'm choosing California. Or you can actually promote to the whole United States. It depends on your uh on your uh California. It's supposed to have come up. You can see California City, United States. So that means I'm only targeting only people in California in the United States. Meaning that people outside California are, cannot see this ad. Even though you're in the US, I'm only targeting what people in what California. So why are we not targeting Nigerians? Because Nigerians don't really buy affiliate products very well. You don't let you don't sell that much in Nigeria, so I target it. And uh, now another secret I want to leak out. I, I only tell this to my subscribers. Facebook, if you want your Facebook ad to work best from Nigeria, please and please don't use um if you can create your account, there is a, a way of creating your Facebook account so that when you are promoting uh, uh, products in the US, it works very fine. I don't want to talk about that here because it is out of what we're talking about. So I want to cancel that of Nigeria here. You can see it. I want to cancel Nigeria because I initially included Nigeria. So we are not targeting only California in the US. So then the next thing for us to target, we have done our, uh, our uh, detailed targeting interest. The next thing for us to check here is our age range. So this is another very important aspect. Which people will see this ad? I can't sell my product to a, a, a little a little child that is of 18 years old. Yeah, I know I started my affiliate marketing journey at a tender uh, at a teenage age. I started digital marketing business from a teenage age. So, and uh, I was buying courses even at that at that young age. But a lot of people of these days, these are little boys who don't have money to buy products. They are still getting money from their parents. Most of them are still even uh, just uh, maybe students that just finished secondary school are uh, yet to enroll in, uh, in the university. So they don't have money for that. So I I I will. Put my targeting my listing to what I can give it something like a uh, minimum age should be like 20 or 22, then maximum age should be like 50. So set it like that. I'm going to just leave it this way because of our time. So once you're done setting it up like that, you click on what next. Oh, sorry, before we click on next, next is taking us to a uh, new ad. Before we click on next, we need to go back to our ad sets and actually look at our um, our what did the uh dice audience we have not looked at our placements our placement is very important another impact important aspect that many persons miss is running out on facebook they just keep on wasting their money targeting the whole placement please that is not how to run out on facebook so let's look at placement let's go back to our test our ad set and look at placements so right here now, don't use automatic placement. Automatic placement, Facebook is going to mark all the old placements for you. Look at manual, click on manual placement. Okay? Click on manual placement and select the placement you want to use. Please, use this placement. I, As I said, I am experienced in adverts. Not only Facebook ad, Google ad, YouTube ad, anything I'm teaching you, it comes from the experience. I know many persons who know about ad are also watching this video. I know I'm not going into details and telling you some certain things I supposed to tell you because I just want to go straight to the point and hit it on the nail on the most important thing you need to know running ad. Now, but please and please consider this placement. I, I've gotten a lot of persons who say they will just, just leave it at automatic is the best. And do you know what it means? It means that Facebook will be showing your ad to people on um Facebook Marketplace, on video feeds, on uh, columns, Instagram Explore. And at the end, you will get up, you, you'll be seeing like 100,000 people are seeing your ad, but you won't be getting no results. The results will be so poor. So which placement is the best for this kind of advert? It's called Facebook feeds and Instagram feeds. If you are running a video ad, you cannot use what? E-stream. So I'm going to unmark all the other one. I'm going to leave this Facebook here. Feast. I will leave the Facebook feeds. I will leave Instagram feeds. I will untick other ones. Marketplace. No, I don't need you. Then uh, Instagram, Messenger Boss, or oh, this one, I don't need you. 
stories. I don't need you. Let me scroll down again. You can see them. There are see more. So uncheck other ones. Uncheck other ones. If your video, if it's a video advert, you can only leave in stream. In stream videos, if it's a video advert, then if it's an image you are using to run the advert, just check only that too. You can see in stream. We're not using we're not using video. I, I won't check it. So search engine, I won't check it. Now this search now is talking about Facebook showing you ads for people that are searching outside Facebook. People that are watching the uh, going to going to see the ad outside Facebook. See on check it. I have my reasons, very strong reasons why I say you should check these things, and they will help you a lot. If you don't want to check it, trust me, you'll be wasting money running this ad and you'll not get the best results. But if you do what I said you should do, just you can run two ad campaign and try it. The same but the same budgeting, the same campaign, and uh, the same uh, uh audience, but just check. Tick all the placements in one and select only these two placements in the other one and check the results. Then get back to me and tell me if what I told you is true or it's not true. Now I'm checking all these ones in, uh, in article. I don't want it. Facebook article. I don't want it as well. So once you are done on checking them, then you click on next or you can come and click on this place or you click on next. Anyone I click here. Our video is getting too long, so I'll try to rush up just the network is slowing. Now, if this is you now come and name your ad just as we have named our first uh, uh campaign, this is our campaign name test campaign, this ad set name, this now the ad itself. This we were setting up the ad itself. That is the ad copy. Then you come and rename your ad copy. Uh you can let's leave it at the at the, at the default name, new ad. So um here you select an Instagram account you want to use because why because i selected instagram feed if you don't want to select you can use you can tell them to use a uh, um your facebook page and since you, this is your first time of running a facebook ad here they will ask you to select to create a facebook page so you can click on it then you take it for facebook page so if you have not created it already if you've created it you can select it from here if you have not you can create a new facebook page from here then once you are done you connect your instagram account or you, you select Facebook, I won't be able to uh, finish up this ad because of our time. So I'll just run through everything. So to show you everything, how it works, you select your Facebook page from here. Then, um, having done that, you will come to this place. This this part is actually the most important part. I I, I, I Trust me, I'm going to make a new video later on, on Facebook ad alone. So we will be teaching you, uh, see a free video online. See a free video on YouTube, but I'll just go through the Facebook ad so you can be able to understand the step by step process on how to go about everything. Because with time, I, I already scheduled this video to stop once it's uh, uh, less than an hour, close an hour, so and it's almost getting to an hour. So uh, I don't want the video to build an hour, I don't want us to want the video to stop on the way. So now, this place they ask you to use single video or image, so you're going to use either. A video or image so and uh for here i say we are going to be using video or you depends on the one you want to use and you select the video you want to use having done that this way you select it you can see here uh -huh. you select it from here you can see edit video select this or edit can you see it then once you are done that you come to this primary test this way you you, you keep you put in the test this way you run the ad people on facebook what are they going to see now you should be able to get people's attention when you are selling a product no matter what you want, what you are selling if it's a risk what you are promoting you should be able to what get people's attention to buy what you want to buy because if you don't grab their attention this is the secret of facebook ad or the secret of advert is to first grab the attention of your prospect he's not a buyer yet um, many of them don't even know if you are real. People, people are scams online. Most people that see your ad on Facebook, a lot of people run out on Facebook. They are seeing different ad. Some of them has been scammed before, so you don't blame them when they see an ad like that. They say, "Look at another scam." So you don't, you don't, you don't, you don't, you don't uh, judge them by that because people have been have experienced a lot of scams. But since you are real, you also need to get your prospect attention so that they can at least click on the link. Because once they're able to click on the link. Two things have happened. You you'll be able to get their email address, their names and their email. That means they are already your customer for life. How? Later on, you are going to import that email address 
and send it to your autoresponder and with your autoresponder you start doing what we call email marketing for them you will now start selling your product to them in the, via email marketing i'm sorry that i don't know newbies might not be able to understand this um okay let's let me proceed so once you are done you create your uh, your uh, your ad copy uh once you're done creating your ad copy that is your, your that test you, you include your image you are done creating your image putting your image then you come here remember this is primary test is where you put your primary test this headline is optional all you need to put yeah uh, is to put your headline let's say i'm running something like i'm, I'm put a, uh a must watch or something like that just put a heading, a, a catchy heading this second description is optional don't you don't put it but this please this headline that you wrote optional make sure you put it if it is lead generation then you can leave it in sign up your call to action you can leave it in sign up there are many many call to action there then you come down let me show you what makes lead generation unique it is actually called your form now in lead generation ad you can create a form inside facebook now this form is actually what you need a website to create is what you call your landing page this is your landing page so you can create your own landing page on facebook all you need to do is to create on create form once you can see the forms i have created you can see it's forest on youtube editor uh, for youtube you can see them different different ad so these are these are different um adverts that i've run before that's why i've seen it here now once you click on what create lead form it will take you to a place you create the lead form okay it's loading already so here we are actually creating a landing page that when people click that our ad copy they're going to see on facebook it will automatically lead, it will lead them to another place on fa inside facebook a pop-up will show them it will not be like it's leading them out of facebook you see that is why lead generation is actually the best for me i've been using this lead generation to crush a lot of things to get subscribers a lot of subscribers and to get sales very well anything you can do with traffic lead generation solve it and more cheaper and faster for you so because lead generation means that everything is done on facebook all right i think it's delaying i promise to make a new video on 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 art for you on this lead generation we couldn't come we are not able to finish this particular ad i was thinking we we can be able to beat up the time our time is fast spent as you can see this already 53 minutes gone so getting to an hour and i don't want the video to what stop by itself so i'll be stopping here but meanwhile in case you need my ad the full training on advert where i teach different kind of advert because what makes your business outstanding is the advert listen to me if you are a newbie and you want to make money online stop wasting your time looking for free means online I always tell people this and they think maybe because i want their money or that. no i want you to succeed get a coach first get a mentor get a training this thing is very very important it's extremely important get someone who will guide you hand to hand get a friend a, a, a training not an ebook ebook doesn't work again get a video training from a coach who is knowing that is reliable and his, his courses are well detailed and who will also give you time and pay attention to you and that is how you can be able to learn a particular skill. It might be on freelancing, it might be dropshipping, it might be e-commerce, it might be affiliate marketing, digital marketing, forex trading, cryptocurrency trading, and any online business you want to do. This is actually what I do on a daily basis. And if you want me to be your mentor, you want me to mentor you on these businesses, you want me to take you by hand and teach you affiliate marketing from scratch, how you can be able to earn at least two to three thousand dollars monthly from uh, Digital24. You can earn from uh warrior plus the same amount you can earn from jvc the same amount these are the only affiliate marketing platform i use currently now apart from um cpa uh marketing apart from cpa marketing when it comes to pure affiliate marketing these are the ones i use and i also apart from recording affiliate marketing platforms which i also do that is the ones that pay you every month now this particular one i use it i, I have a training on this on affiliate marketing I thought in that affiliate marketing, I'll be giving you, if you get my training on affiliate marketing, I'll be giving you my free traffic ways, that free source of traffic. I'll also be giving you my ad copy. Then my ad copy is actually sold for 20k. I'll be giving it to you for free of charge. Free of charge. My ad copy, that is where I teach people both how to run ad, Facebook ad from start to finish. I talk about all the objective, starting from traffic, 
to all the objective on Facebook. I talk about how you can be able to run YouTube ad, Google ad, and also I talk about some free ad also. And I also give you access to my free viral traffic, not the old viral traffic where I talk about PPV ad network. Uh, uh, this is total new viral traffic ad machine on it. Only getting my affiliate marketing course. It's detailed course. It's a course that will help you to make a whole lot of money. So if you are in need, all you need to do is to chat me up. I'll drop my uh, mobile number in the description. Just chat me up with my mobile number and request for it. It's only 20k. It costs you only 20k as of the time I'm speaking now. My to get my affiliate marketing course, but I can give you guarantee that it's gonna make you tons of cash. So if you need my affiliate marketing course, get back with you. Uh, if you don't have the amount to get my affiliate marketing course, there is no issue at all. Just keep on the channel. Anytime I upload new video, make sure you come, come to watch because one of these days I'll upload a video that will actually touch about what I've talked about in my paid courses. As I've seen now, I never talked about Facebook ad before, but now I'm talking about it because I see a lot of persons are struggling with new traffic sources. And the next ad I'll be teaching after concluding my this training course on, on uh, Facebook, I'll make a new video on Facebook, only on Facebook ad, where I'll talk about uh, everything from beginning to the end. And the next one will actually be on this new ad network that I told you that is 10 times cheaper than Facebook. All right. Now, why? Let me just go through this before we feel, before I pause the video or we end the video, the training. You can see here is where you change your, uh, change the campaign, the, the, your form name. That is your landing page name. So here you are seeing your introduction. All right. So you put your introduction here. So, um, other thing is the truck is even delaying us. So once I click on this place now, I click on this drop down arrow, it's going to show you where I can include my introduction. And also, if you don't have a privacy, you can use my own privacy and all that. And this completion is also included a thank you page and all that. Uh, say, uh, I can't be able to continue this training and finish up because it will take us time to create our form, a little time, at least five, five more minutes to create our form. And then once we are done creating the form, all the next thing for us to do is what? Include our track and track our ad. Please, many person don't like tracking this. They, they since they think it's a waste of time. It's very important. Tracking is extremely important. Make sure you track each of your ad. Once you are done with that, if you are done, you save it. And once you are done saving and draft, you click on publish. Then you now click on publish here. If you can actually figure out the remaining ones yourself, if you cannot, stay tuned to my ad. Stay tuned to my upcoming video. I will be talking about advert on my upcoming video. So stay tuned to it. I'll make a new video on adverts and I'll be able to complete this video uh, on lead generation. I'll talk about traffic. I'll talk about uh, all that conversion. These three are the ones people actually need depending on the business they want to go into. Stay blessed.